Hello, this is MakerJ101, and lately I've been playing around with Jewel Thieves. They're pretty neat little circuits that are that will take 1.5 volts in and put out enough power to run an LED. Um, normal Jewel Thieves circuits have two um, two windings around the troid, but this one here is a little different. I added a third winding that's a bit longer, and it puts out enough power to run a neon light bulb which is probably at least 50 volts. So yeah. And I took that concept a little bit farther with the third winding. And so I wrapped, I used the, instead of a troid, I used the um, very core of a um, flyback transformer. And so I'm basically just using the um, the high voltage wire in here. So as a third winding. So it's a, basically three winding jewel thief. It's got three winding. So I've got my biggest uh, real thick, 30 turns of real thick wire here, 20 turns of a smaller gauge wire. Um, so yeah. Here are the transistors that I'm using for it. I've got two of these transistors hooked in parallel, so I've got double the amps. And then over here I've got a... Uh, 50 ohm resistor that I made out of a whole bunch of little springs because I couldn't find one that was 50 ohms that was that could handle that am many amps and then here's the circuit well these transistors are the best ones I could find um, that would make the biggest spark this one was the best though and but it burned out because the um, high voltage accidentally hit the wire and killed it. But this one is a 2N3055 and it will put out 1 and 1 fourth inch sparks. So that one was really good, but it burned out. So pretty much any transistor, large transistor, will work. These ones work pretty good, but these ones work better because I guess because they're bigger. These were actually from a TV, so or a CRT monitor. The flyback transformer that I'm using here, I'm using this one instead of like those ones because there's more room in between here so I can get wires in there. These ones here, it would be very hard, or it would take a while to get the windings around there because this, because it's set in there. This one also has the same problem. So that's why I'm using this one. Um, here's the circuit I drew up using this one, using this transistor. So if you want to look at that. And then here's the normal Jewel Thief circuit. Probably already know that. So now I'll show you it working here. Turn on the 12 volt power supply. Oh, wait a minute. Something. I'm unhooked, I think. Yeah, so it's pretty powerful. So, yeah. In later video, I'll show um, what you can do with this high voltage. That's about it. Thanks for watching.